Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel where we are having trading sessions together. If you are new to this channel, I really advise you to subscribe to this channel because I have a lot of useful content for your trading and it might help you to boost your trading experience. All the important information about our trading session today I am going to tell you right now. Guys, in this video I'm going to show you how I trade using Bollinger Bands Indicator. And uh, I will start today with $70 on my deposit. My goal is to increase this amount up to $10,000. And I will use uh, a time frame of 15 seconds as always. And I will open uh, deals mainly for one minute, guys. And uh, I think that's it for now. Watch this video, guys, till the end. I hope you will find something useful for yourself. And maybe you like this way of trading and you, you will like this strategy. So you would use it on your own trading. So guys, now let's analyze the market situation and try to choose the first entry point. As you can see, after the upward movement, the price hit the red level and couldn't, uh, couldn't go higher. Uh, at the same time, it moved to the lower zone of the Bollinger channel and has been moving there for some time. After several uh, long red candles in a row, I decided to go down for two minutes. As you can see, we have chosen a good entry point. This is how we made the money on our first deal. Now let's see what happens in the market next. The price tested the support level, but then the chart crossed the middle line of the indicator from the bottom up. And the price began to ethically, actively pay off and after repeated testing of this level at the intersection of the middle Bollinger line uh, graph, I want to try to make some kind of upward movement and I will open a deal with $133. During this time, the chart managed to go much higher, which brings us profit from this deal, guys. As we can see, the price continues to go up since there is still a resistance level above where the price can go to test on a growing um, green candle from the middle line up. I will open a deal with $254 to go up for one minute. As a result, we managed to close above the entry point and we earned, guys. Let's find the next entry point. Now, after the rollback, the price is bought off by impulse green candles, touching the upper border of the Bollinger indicator. Considering that the chart has not yet reached the resistance level, I think this scenario remains relevant. So, I will go up with $485, guys. As we can see at the beginning, the price showed a good growth, but then the same good pullback, so our position was almost knocked out, but we still managed to close the deal with the profit, so this is the most important. Next, we see that uh, the price wasn't enough to touch the resistance level, and after a small flat, the chart crosses the average moving indicator from top to bottom which in this case may indicate the attenuation of the upward movement. Therefore, at the next red candle, I will open a deal with the entire deposit to go down. During this time, a decrease occurs on the chart and we are making profit, guys, from this deal. As you can see, the next maximum on the chart was formed below the previous one which may indicate the weakness of the upward movement. The price is traded in the lower zone of the Bollinger price channel and considering that for a long time uh, the chart has been moving within the boundaries, I have indicated coming now to the red, then to the green level. I think this time the price will continue to move to the green level and I open the deal to go down. 
During this time, the price decreases on the chart, which allows us to close in profit, guys. So guys, let's see what the market situation is next. The price settled below the green support level and traded for some time in the upper zone of the Bollinger price channel. Then uh, the chart crosses the moving average of the indicator from top to bottom. After which I opened the deal to go down. The amount of my transaction is $3,363. And I see that our deal is closing below the entry point. This is how we made money on this transaction, guys. Now let's find another entry point, guys. After updating the minimum on the chart, the price began to pay off and went to the upper limit of the Bollinger indicator. In such a situation, I think that the price will test the green level and uh, enter into the transaction with the entire deposit up for one minute. So, as you can see, the chart is testing the resistance level and we are making profit from this transaction, guys. Uh, now, I have $12,141 on my deposit. My original goal was $10,000 and it fulfilled completely, even more than I expected. So guys, my trading plan is fulfilled and I think this is the end of our trading session. That's it for today, guys. As you could see, all the market situations worked out perfectly today. Also, guys, I hope you got to know how to work with Bollinger Bands Indicator. If you still don't feel confident enough, you can watch my other videos about how to trade with Bollinger Bands Indicator. And when you're gonna start trade, just turn on this indicator and try to find similar situations in the market, similar situations we worked out on our trading session today, and try to trade, because only through your own experience you will be able to get a great result. Practice makes perfect, because after you watched my videos about trading, don't forget to practice yourself, and I wish you to have a great luck on that. Guys, don't forget to subscribe to this channel, put a big thumbs up to this video, and turn on notifications so you don't miss my new video. It's the best way to support me and my channel. Also, guys, I have a closed group where I'm sharing trading signals for free. These are my trading signals. And if you want to get them super easy, just text me code word signal on my Telegram. The link will be down below. And guys, I wish you to have a successful trading session, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!